So this is actually really good. We got this map for the PPSH. Oh, it's free for all too. Heck yes. This could be a nice little quick video about the PPSH. Because the PPSH is exactly that, you know, it's a close range SMG, so you want to do this on close maps. It's pretty useless at long range in my opinion because the recoil is ridiculously high. And two, um, the rate of fire is crazy high. But if you use it at close range, then like, hey, you know, it's, it's really good. Mag size, typical for any SMG really, you know. I'm not a fan though of the hollow site. Like whoever is, right? So we'll put this on there. Uh, but yeah, other than that, I don't really recommend the PPSH. It's kind of bad, honestly, in my opinion. I just don't think it's like anything sick. And considering it's from the World War II pass, you know, you have to, uh, considering it's from the World War II pass, you have to, um, spend 7,000 credits to unlock it. And it's like, in my opinion, is it worth 7,000 credits when you could buy, like, what else can you do with 7,000 credits though, realistically, except buy like cosmetics or something, right? But that's my opinion. I don't really think it's worth it. I kind of wanted to, I want to, I would probably buy like the FMG. The FMG I, I've seen was really good. Of course, I wouldn't get those devils, man. Uh, I would probably have bought like the FMG maybe, I don't know. I mean, I, the PPSH is a weapon that I love in general, so I don't really like regret buying it. Because like you never know how it's going to be until you actually use it yourself. I just wish like it was more of like capable. And not just like close range. Like, would I recommend it? I mean, yeah, like on a map like this, yes. But like overall, like you're not gonna wanna use this on a lot of the maps. Just because of like the high recoil and everything else, I just wouldn't, I just can't really recommend it 100%, you know? I don't really regret ever buying anything in this game, even like cosmetics, man, come on, my keyboard, my mouse, I mean, hit my keyboard, and I couldn't slide my mouse any farther to the left on that guy. Um, like, that's what I'm saying though, right? So like, I don't really regret buying anything in this game, because it, one, it's all virtual, right? Two, what does it really matter? You know, credits are credits, right? But I would say that like, It's not as good as I had hoped. Like, the PPSH, when I first saw it, was, like, in the game. I was, like, honestly really happy, and then I kind of get it, and it's like, okay. It's actually not that sick. It's kind of overrated. Like, whenever a new weapon drops, you always expect it to be crazy good. Right? Because, like, they add the passes like that. Okay, most points. Most eliminations second most eliminations. They add weapons like that in the passes to try and earn themselves money, which I totally understand. So like they want to always like kind of hype everything up like that and all that, you know, so that people want to buy the World War II passes and they get money. Nothing wrong with that at all. I would say though, I'm going to throw in some granulated tape probably. Maybe like one of the stocks, like a padded stock or something. Or the invader down the line. Just because like the recoil is very high. It's actually not bad with the grip if you can like control it. But um, I think I also got... We have one more for Damascus Gold on this. So yeah. 
But anyways, that's the PPSH.